Hey, so I'm gonna make this quick video going over regex and PoE. You know, what is regex, why it's so important, and all that. Um, this is really important for 8 mod mapping, but even if you're just doing regular out and go mapping, it's very, very useful. So I wanted to make this video because I got this question all the time on my stream, like, you know, what's your regex and all that. The reason why I'm not sharing my regex this league is what, what happened last league, where, you know, my MF build got a really popular last league, and so many people used the same regex that I posted in the POB that it got to the point where. Um, it was pretty much like unusable because like it just sold out everywhere like uh, if you tried to buy the regex on TFT It was like 20 C over price or whatever so, Yeah, that's why I'm not sharing my regex and then more so just want to teach people how to make a regex I think it's a lot better this way. You know, just make your own. It's really really easy. It's not that hard at all So let's just get to it So what, what is a regex? So a regex is essentially a code um, that you will put into the game and it will filter out the maps for you. That is pretty much the gist of it So let's just say man, I, you know, you just can't do reflect Right, you then copy clip both these reflect things click on copy You paste into the game And now it'll highlight every map that doesn't have reflect so all these unhighlighted maps have reflect So yeah, this is the basic of what a regex is so if you want to make a good regex for Avon mapping, it's very, very important to know what the good mods are and the bad mods are. So let's say you're playing Elemental Tornado Shot, right? Map build. Um, you obviously, you can't do LA Reflect and you can't do Fizz Reflect. But if you have Charms, for example, like this one, you can do LA Reflect, right? So it depends. Do you want to switch out a Charms to the LA Reflect? If the answer is yes, then, you know, have a in the regex or not. Yeah, let's say, for example, I can't do air reflect because I have the charm. Um, Fizz reflect, you can't do as elemental TS because you're not fully converted. Keep that in mind. So you would need another charm for that to uh, get Fizz immune. If you're Fizz to cold TS, you can do Fizz reflect. Yeah, so what's some other uh, bad ones? So, for example, my build, you can do cannot regen. You can do cannot leech as long as you have a source of mana and life on hit. So in this build, you have mana on hit on Primal Spirit and life on hit on... Uh, if get on hit node. Um monsters deal chaos damage is extra uh and monsters deal extra fizz is, is chaos damage. Um this mod is really really bad if you have no chaos resist. So if you have like negative 60% chaos resist, you want to make sure you regex this out because it, you just should just get one shot. If you have like zero percent, ten percent, or like negative ten percent chaos for us, it's just fine to run. But yeah. If you have literally no chaos res, make sure you don't run this mod. You will just get one shot. So yeah, hexproof. Hexproof is like pretty bad because you had to do service mark. But you know, I personally run it. You can't you know regex out every mod. So keep in mind that like some mods you just have to run. So you, you gotta pick and choose like what's a good mod, what's a bad mod. Um, this one is terrible. Uh, players have reduced effect of non curse auras because uh, you are running this top half on your tree, and this is a sixty percent increase effect. So this reduced effect on curse auras goes to 96%, which essentially means you don't have auras. And you know, if you're playing my build, you're running like six auras. So that's not good, right? Definitely don't want to run this. Other bad mods. Uh, turbo can be really, really bad, especially this league because it combos with uh, the yellow juice in the wildwood. Monsters can be stupidly fast. Um, personally, I would regex this out this league. It sometimes isn't that bad. Your choice, you want to regex this one out or not. Um, other really bad mods, we'll get down below. Uh, you would think this is bad mod, Elemental Resist, but it's actually not. Um, I personally always run this. The reason why it's not that bad, because you do have Inverted Resist from your Elemental Mastery, which makes this mod not that bad. So personally, I do run it. Like I said, you do have to run you know, some bad mods. This mod is really really bad um essentially it makes you go to like zero percent spell suppression um you can only spell suppress like 12 percent damage and yeah your evasion also becomes almost useless because monsters have increased accuracy highly recommend to regex this mod out it is very very bad more so this league last league wasn't that bad uh, reducing answer crits this one is extremely bad as well the reason why is once again because of the top half of your tree with an increased effect all these nodes this becomes like 66 percent damage reduction from crits meaning you're dealing one third of the damage and this is a league where you need a lot of damage right so having this on your maps means you're 
you're like pretty much just not going to do damage at all. Um, so yeah, I highly recommend not doing this mod. I would use flash charges pretty bad, but I run it. Um, it's not, you know, if you are at like a different build, maybe a Pathfinder, maybe you don't want this uh, mod on because you always want your flask up or whatever. Uh, cooldown recovery can be really bad depending on your ability plan. It's not bad for my build, but this one can be really, really bad if you are cooldown reliant. Um, and another really, really bad mod, let's type it in, is uh, Monsters Gain Maximum Life as Extra Maximum Energy Shield. This mod is really bad as well. This is like 60 to 70%, um, like over 70% more life essentially. Uh, yeah, so I really don't recommend running this mod. It's like doubles the health like every mod in your map. A uh, monster life can also be bad, but your know, monster life a lot of times can just have really low rolls. So it's not that bad. Uh, to show an example here. We have some monster lives on here. This one's 48%, it's not too bad. Uh, 49%. Um, this is like one second roll, like 20%, for example. Yeah, 20% more monster life, right? Like, this is not that bad, you know, with the increased effect. So, like, I personally run monster life, but if you feel like your damage is too, too low, you know, feel free to reject out monster life. So, yeah, this is like a basic regex you could use for like elemental TS. Oh, negative max res can also be pretty bad, but you can also run it. Like I said, personal choice. You have to regex out certain mods, you can't regex out everything. So yeah, uh, these are the mods I would highly recommend to regex out. Would it vastly help your uh, eight mod map in as doing a regex is essentially just as important as gearing your character, right? If you do all these bad mods, it doesn't matter how geared your character is, right? If you're doing like non-curse orders from skills and monsters take reducing action crits, your character's gonna do no damage. So yeah, it's very, very important. Uh, Void Elemental can also be very, very bad if you're playing like a Ignite build. Um, even for like LATS, you can't freeze a shock, it is bad, but I do run it. Right, you can't register every mod. Uh, also, one bad mod if you're playing a poison build, never run this. Chance to avoid poison. This is very, very bad. Just let you know. So, yeah, that's the basic like what a regex uh, what should look like, um, what a regex is. So, like now if I put this in my PUE, it will highlight every map that does not have the mods I just listed out. So all these maps I can run freely and it's not bad at all. And all these maps, you know, grayed out, I can't run. And one other thing, if you're doing stuff like Abyss, for example, is I want these mods. So when you're doing Abyss, you usually want um, monsters fire two additional projectiles. So if you add this on, now it'll show every map that has two additional proj and the maps you want. Of course, there's a lot less maps because that's a very specific mod. But yeah, uh, using this side, it can also be very, very useful. And you can just add quant or pack size up here. But keep in mind that this does add a lot of lines to your regex and you can't have more than 50 characters used. This is why you can't you know, regex out everything. So yeah, I hope this helped a lot of people of what to do with your regex. Um, it is very, very important. And yeah, if you have any questions, Feel free to leave a comment below. I also stream daily on Twitch. So yeah, that's about it though.